Welcome to another segment of Tame Your Debt. Today, we're going to be discussing steps to creating a budget. I understand that the word budget can be very scary, and most people don't want to budget, know how to budget, or even understand what it means to budget. So today I'm gonna to explain a couple of things that are really important before you even consider budgeting. First of all, let's understand what budgeting means. It simply means understanding what money comes into your house and what money leaves your house. When you understand that, you are on your way to creating a budget. So the first step is understanding what that means. You earn money or you make money in some way and that money is what comes in. Then you have bills and expenses. Those are items like rent, it could be a mortgage, house, cell phone, cable vision bill, it could be anything like that, food bills as well. So you need to write down all of the things that you spend money on every single month. That includes toilet paper, it includes stamps, it includes Starbucks, and it includes anything and anywhere your money goes. Yeah. Once you know that, you'll be completely prepared to create your budget. So, once you know what goes in your house and leaves your house, you can then determine what are fixed expenses and what are variable expenses. Fixed expenses are things that don't change every month. That might be your car payment, your rent payment. Those things stay the same. A variable payment is something that might come and go. So you might see insurance payments at different times of the year, a food bill could be a variable, and gas could be a variable. Those are items that could change on a weekly, daily, or monthly basis. Put them into two different columns. Write down exactly what you have, and then you can see where all your money goes to. Once you understand that, you can determine how much extra funds you have for things like savings, retirement, and uh, vacations, which are really important, and saving for your goals, which could be to buy a house, a bigger house, send your kids to college, pay off other bills. In order to achieve financial related goals, you have to understand what is in your budget. Once you determine what money you have each month, then you could decide what bills you should be paying down faster. I get that question a lot. Where should I put my money? Well, we don't know where to put your money unless you know what your budget is and your goals are. Once you figure that out, and I encourage you to write them down, write down your goals, and then you can figure out exactly where your money should be going and the best way to utilize the services and items that you have in your life. Need more advice? Visit youtube.com forward slash law offices LHT.